chasing the police every single day. County Sheriff's Office. If this is an emergency, please hang up and immediately dial 911. If this is not an emergency, please select one of the following options. At any time, you may dial the extension of the person you are trying to reach. If you are calling to report a non-emergency crime or incident, or would like a deputy or an animal control officer to respond to a non-emergency situation, please press 9. If you would like jail or jail visitation information, one moment, please. They can always call Crime Stoppers. Uh, yes, uh, we're on a recorded line. Uh, I'm a reporter uh, in Charlotte County. We are calling to see, is the sheriff deputy charged with uh, uh, killing... A, uh, a deputy because a dog you consider a, a cop. So is he is he charged with the uh, the crime? I would not be able to to offer any information about that. Um, you would need to talk to our um, our PO. Right. But so so you know that if if a regular person killed a dog you consider a cop, you would charge him with uh, a crime, right? I, I cannot give out any information about that, sir. All right. Uh, all right. We're, we're, so what time is the P.O. back? Um, hold for one moment and I'll find out for you. All right. Okay, sir. The, um, the P.I.O. is Carrie Hortzman. Terry, how do you say last name? It's it's H O R S T M A N. Okay, Hortzman, and okay, what time is uh, he in? Well, you can I can give you the the number to call her. Okay. It would be eight six three two five five eight four four eight. Four eight. Okay, and. All right, uh, so I, I can call her now, or I got to do her during business hours? Yeah, you, no, you can call her now. Okay. All right, appreciate it. Thank you. Uh-huh, bye-bye. All right, bye-bye. Hey, this is Carrie Elazer Horseman with the Polk County Sheriff's Office. Please leave me a message, and I'll call you back as soon as I can. Thank you. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Uh, yes, Terry. Uh, we're on a recorded line. Uh, uh, my name is Annie. I'm a reporter for Charlotte County Cop Watch. Uh, we are trying to find out when are you going to charge uh, the uh, Charlotte County Sheriff Deputy for uh, uh, executing a cop. You guys consider the dog uh, a cop. And uh, if a regular person were to get bit and uh, shoot the dog dead, he would be charged with uh, murder. Uh, so we're trying to find out when you guys are going to charge uh, the deputy with murder because uh, he murdered a cop. Uh, please get back to me. Uh, it's Charlotte County Cop Watch. We're on Facebook, uh, and uh, we're also on YouTube all over the place. Uh, you can find the emails there. You can message us there. We are just wondering when you're going to be, you know, Grady Judge preaches, you know, that, you know, he obeys the law, and uh, he's for the law, he rules by the law. Well, uh, your deputy just killed a cop. When are they going to charge him? Thanks. Bye-bye.
We're learning a Polk County deputy was forced to shoot and kill another deputy's canine on Monday. The Polk County Sheriff's Office saying one of their canine handlers was caring for the dog named Recon. But when he went to check on Recon, the dog bit his hand and would not let go. The deputy who shot the dog will survive. We've told you about Recon in the past. Back in 2017, a burglary suspect tried to choke him during a takedown. Taboo. Hey, Sheriff County, this is Sheriff County Cop Watch. I am using any video here with under fair use. If you uh, have criticism, reporting, teaching, etc., and please donate. I do not make money from YouTube, and uh, there are different ways to donate in the uh, video links. Thanks.